Hi guys, welcome to my channel Tasmia here. In today's video, I'll be sharing on how I use the leftover fabric material that I had of various dresses and made scrunchies out of them. If you find the video helpful, then do subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends. So let's get started. These are the first and basic type of scrunchies. For these, you'll need required measuring fabric, a rubber band, and needle and a thread. The measurement of the fabric you'll need is 17 into 3 inches. Placing the right side on the top, fold on the hemline. Fold the length of the fabric by placing the rubber band in between and we will be stitching the ends together. Here I am using a sewing machine to stitch. You can definitely use a sewing thread and needle and stitch it by hand. It won't give any difference at all. So here the wrong side of the fabric is on the top so we need to flip the fabric to the right side. Attach a pin on one end of the fabric and flip the fabric to the right side on the top just like as I am showing in the video. After flipping right side on the top, we are going to insert one of the ends inside the other and make a running stitch to secure the, the scrunchie. So these are a few pieces I made. Now for the second type of scrunchie you will need 10 cross 2 inches fabric and an elastic. Fold the fabric lengthwise and stitch on the end to make a seam. Remember that we will be folding the right side in and the wrong side of the fabric will be on the top. Once we have completed the stitch, put a pin and flip the right side on the top. Once we have flipped it to the right side, do not forget to iron it. The next step is to put the elastic and make the band. Here I am using an uh, elastic of the length 5 inches.
once we have got the elastic from one end to the other we will be securing the elastic with a stitch line and then securing the fabric stitch line to complete the scrunchie Now the third type is attaching a bow. Now to make the bow you'll require a fabric of the length 20 into 2.5 inch. Fold the fabric lengthwise and on both the ends of the length cut the fabric in diagonal line just as I'm showing. Stitch on the folded edge. Remember here the wrong side of the fabric is on the top while the right side is where we have folded together. Leave a little gap in between so that the fabric can be turned to the right side. Once we have turned the fabric to the right side, stitch on the edge to give a cleaner look. And also yes, the remaining part which we had left to turn the fabric to the right side will also get covered. So here's the bow ready. Take the scrunchie, tie it on the bow and your bow scrunchie is ready. Here's another way of tying the bow to the scrunchie.
if you find the video helpful do hit the like button and subscribe to my channel it will mean the world to me so until next time bye